I hold them and I have a little closer to them in the water. So let us pray, let us consecrate the water, let us want again bless the candidates as they are about. So as the Bible puts it, buried with him in baptism, and that they may raise new life in Christ Jesus. Let us pray. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, we consecrate this water. We thank you, God Almighty, for providing for making it possible for these candidates to identify with you through water baptism. Oh God, I pray that as they, oh Lord God Almighty, will leave the place today, that they will indeed rise to new life in you. I pray God you will empower them. And Lord Almighty God, may they be effective witnesses of God. Remember those who are witnessing this baptism and have not yet.
that the Apostle Paul is speaking to, 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 to those persons at Athens says that in the past God winked at the ignorance of men then but in these days God, God is commanding There is a you, there is a God. That's what your pastor Paul said there. Your pastor Paul says in Acts chapter 17 that we are God's offspring. In him we live and move and have our being. Hence we really are without excuse. That's how I encourage you in these last days. If you didn't believe in the before 2020, you must believe now that we are in the last days. I want you to examine yourself. They are among the numerous number of people who come that will pass the persons who have been before them. And God is still calling on you to surrender your life to Him. I want to pray a closing prayer. God, I believe that God is speaking to somebody who is watching me, which is a family member maybe, who is witnessing and this, who has just witnessed this baptism. And know that God has been calling you. And God is saying, is about time for you. I want you to bow your heart right where you are and let me pray for you. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, I pray for that mother, that son, that daughter, that cousin, that aunt, that family member who really, oh Lord God, you have been calling for the longest while. I pray for grace. I pray that you lead such a person to a place of repentance. Oh God Almighty, you say to us, seek ye the Lord while he may be found. Call upon you while you are near. I pray that you draw them unto yourself and be gracious unto them. I thank you. I give you all the glory and all the honor for the time spent here today. Oh God, may your grace be with the candidates as they go, as they go to live, as they go with your instruction to go in therefore into all the world and to do unto others that which they just received. Oh Lord God, I pray for grace. I pray God for journeying mercy. I pray your blessings on those who journeyed with us and were able to share in this time of baptism. I pray for your blessings and your healing on those who are witnessing this live streaming. We give you thanks and we give you glory. In Jesus' precious name. And everybody say, dominion and majesty both now and forevermore amen and amen god bless you put your hands together for the lord put your hands together for the candidate praise god god bless you